sometimes go to your checkbook. Okay, now I was wondering how I was going to talk to uh, children about a checkbook because most of the time all they see their parents use are check cards. But uh, most of us have checkbooks, at least we have ledgers. And so I thought we'd go and see what the Bursar priorities are with just a few uh, things in, your, in our checkbook today. <laughs> Those of you who don't know, that's my wife, who apparently doesn't like the last few uh, notations in the checkbook. Because, you know, it says where your priorities are in your checkbook. I'm just going to take a couple of them, okay? Cokesbury. That sounds pretty religious, doesn't it? That was one of my notations. <laughs> Yankee Candle. Okay, here's one for the orthodontist. Uh, Here's one to one of our kids. Uh, Pac Sun. Anybody ever heard of Pac Sun? Okay, I want to tell you how much that was worth. El Ron Rodeo. Yeah. Classic Diner. Another transfer to a child who needed money. Lone Star. You see a pattern here? Walgreens. Wawa. Hickory United Methodist Church. <laughs> Hickory United Methodist Church. Um, and Angie's. So, it appears to me that the Mercer family likes to clothe itself and to eat well. <laughs> uh, that may be our priorities. Uh, oh, Coles, yes. <laughs> Y'all have to be up here to see the eyes I'm getting. <laughs> but it's a good exercise to see because what your checkbook says says a whole lot about your priorities in life. Jesus put it this way, where your treasure is, there will your heart be also. And I'm going to quit this message right now while my wife is still speaking to me. <laughs> She's not. It's too late. <laughs>